Don't you think it's funny how that intro plays and like in that intro, I'm like all done up and then here I am, boom, I come on and I like have no makeup on. <laughs> I'm Laura and you're watching Atomic News TV. Surprise! I just got out of the shower, but we're in a polar vortex right now and I was cold and I had to get in like a steaming hot shower and warm up. But um, I know I just made a video of like an hour ago, but I have some new information and I had to share that with you. But before I get into it, make sure you hit that like button. Make sure you hit subscribe and hit that bell icon so you can see updates about this and everything else political. So let's do it. All right. I know we've been playing the game of where is Waldo and... Where on earth is Carmen San Diego in regards to Ruth Bader Ginsburg? Yeah, nobody knows where she is, but on the deep dark web right now, it is being said that she is not dead. I know we've had the question of whether or not she's dead, okay? In fact, I think it was about a week ago on Fox and Friends. They accidentally, due to technical difficulties or whatever their stupid excuse was, played an image of her with the year she was born and then this year being the year that she died. Oops. Okay, but here's the lowdown. They're saying she is not dead. Now I'm going to read my notes here. But due to infections and complications from her lung cancer surgery, she is in a medically induced coma at a medical facility under heavy surveillance in a location that is supposed to be somewhere in the Southwest. And when I first heard that, I was like, Area 51. <laughs> I can't help it. The conspiracy theorist in me. But I don't know. Okay. Um, now, why would they keep her in a medically induced coma? Okay. It's being hidden, they say, because she's deathly ill. She's like knocking on death's door. The Grim Reaper is ready and waiting to go. But they are doing everything anything they can to keep her alive right now, including life support if they have to, because the Dems, want, the Democrats or the Dems, whatever you want to call them, uh, want to cover it up and keep it out of the spotlight. They want it to kind of blow over right now and not be the main focus of politics right now. Um, they want to keep her alive as long as they can. Why would they want to do that? Because they don't want Donald Trump to elect another SCOTUS. And that, ma that makes complete sense. They don't want another conservative SCOTUS. They don't want a SCOTUS that is constitutionally inclined to follow his lead. You know what I mean? And that makes total sense. They want to keep it going, this facade, this sh charade, whatever you want to call it, until the 2020 elections. Now, what is she, 84? I don't know if an 84-year-old who is that ill is going to make it until 2020, but they're sure as hell going to try, and they're probably footing the, the bill for it, Okay. There's probably a Democratic pool going on right now with money trying to keep that lady alive just so they don't give it to Trump. And then once 2020 comes around, they're hoping a Democrat will be in office and then the Democrat that's in office will pick a Democrat-focused 
SCOTUS. See how that works? If you think about it, it makes complete sense. But how sad that they would screw around with the health of an old woman just to further their agenda. Now, like I said in a previous video, I do get some confidential information leaked to me. I have a couple sources. One is a major source. This one, this is the only piece of information this person has supplied to me so far. We've talked a lot about a lot of things, but this is the only piece of information that they have shared. Okay. And this is from honestly the deep dark web. Okay. Like in the deepest, darkest caverns of the internet. This is where it's been found. Okay. Um, do I have proof in my hand? right now to serve up to you that this is true and correct? No. So take this for what it is, okay? Could it be true? It's possible. I wouldn't put it past a Democrat to do that. But it's up to you to decide. Put your thoughts and comments below. What do you think? Where on earth is Ruth Bader Ginsburg? Until next time, guys. Peace out.